With Christmas around the corner, we're all fretting over what to buy the car lovers in our lives. Well, we might not need fret any longer because I found this. It costs just 30 quid, doesn't need any batteries and could provide hours of entertainment. It's an in-car sound generator. It's called the Sound Racer and claims to give any car the engine note of a V8 or a V10 through the car's speakers. You plug it into the 12 volt socket, tune the car's FM radio to the Sound Racer's transmitting frequency and then calibrate it to match your car's revs. It'll give you a beep when it's figured out where idle is. When the revs of the engine rise, so does the current going into the fag lighter and the sound racer detects this and plays out a higher or lower engine note accordingly. So basically, think of it like this. More revs equals more electricity equals more noise. I'll try out the V10 first and see if it's any good. What you're about to hear will sound exactly like a Lamborghini Gallardo. Whoa, really high revving. Lamborghini Gallardo. That's really odd. You get to 3,000 RPM, and because you can't hear the engine, the actual engine, it feels like you're about to bust the pistons out the side. But you're not. Like that, 2,500 RPM. Three sounds like my Gallardo wants to change up. Yeah, it sort of works, but it, even though I've calibrated it properly, it doesn't really match it. That sounds like the red line maybe in the Gallardo, and it's just three and a half thousand RPM, so it doesn't really feel in sync with my revs. Ah oh dear, I don't like that. That was 4,000 RPM and it started to go a bit flaky, so I'm not impressed at all to be honest. If it cost just a tenner, the quirks would be forgivable for a quick laugh, but at 30 quid, it's a bit disappointing. Maybe the V8 will fare better. So I'm hoping for this to sound exactly like a TVR Griffith 500. Nice V8. It's meaty. It's burbly. Yeah. It's making me drive all lazily. Oh, yeah. Sort of. Second. This is more satisfying. I prefer having a TVR than having a fake Lamborghini. But I think still, it sounds higher than the actual engine does, which is a bit off-putting to be honest, it makes you change gear too soon. Fun, but I just don't trust it. So, is the Sound Racer worth a Christmas flutter? If you want one, you can get one from clickshop.com and, well, it'll keep a car geek happy for a few hours, but to be honest, it's not gonna hold anyone's attention for that long. Me, I'd rather just have 30 pounds worth of petrol for Christmas.